absolutely disgusting. Voyeur hid under vehicles at Cash Wash to stare at women's feet. There's no way he's coming back for a third time. He keeps walking back and forth and you'll see him do that. He's watching to see what she's doing. When we talk to her, she's in the back seat vacuuming her car on that driver's side and he slips up underneath that front tire. He was out underneath the vehicle for about five to six minutes, I wanna say, and then he slips out and goes to this back passenger tire and is like trying to fiddle with it, making it seem like he's there the entire time. Ah, Arizona, the Florida of the West. I can't think of a more fitting way to end the month of September than with a little Maricopa County criminal act Activity. I found your guy, ladies. I found your lover. I found a man that will worship the ground that you walk on and the feet that you use to do it. A man previously cited for hiding under women's vehicles to stare at their feet did it again at a car wash this summer, according to cops in the city of Gilbert, Arizona, which he thought he was going to turn it all around. Jesse Michael Johnson, 28, is charged with voyeurism and disorderly conduct, according to Phoenix Fox affiliate KSAZ. In separate incidents, three women were vacuuming their SUVs at a superstar car wash location near Riggs Road and Val Vista Drive like a watering hole. But for feet, in these three incidents, defense pulled into a parking spot next to the victim, cops wrote. While each victim was vacuuming her vehicle, defendant hid under her SUV and spent several minutes under her vehicle. The defendant climbed out from under the vehicle when each victim was finishing her vacuuming and left the area. Here at these vacuums that Jesse Johnson was caught on camera, employees that were here that day tell me that Johnson had a membership here, would get his car washed and would wait. Police say he did this three times on one day to three women. Do you know how committed you have to be to staring at someone's tootsies to lay on the Arizona asphalt in the middle of the summer? It melts people's sneakers. You can fry an egg. You can bake bread. In a parallel universe, this guy would be a five-star detective solving crimes based on what people did with their feet at the murder scene. Surveillance footage caught a man in the act. Cops say that is Johnson. Damn right it's Johnson. Who who else would it be? He's the alpha foot freak. There's some other guys out there, but no one's getting up on feet quite like him in these streets. He was arrested Tuesday and held on a $10,000 bond. At one point, you can see his head pop out on the driver's side looking up at me. One of the women, Chanel, told AZ family, I just never would have thought in a million years that there would be someone underneath of my car. Surveillance footage showed the perpetrator return to his vehicle and act like he was cleaning one of his tires. All of the victims had flip-flops and shorts on. That's what we all had in common. Chanel said, yeah, he likes an all-natural foot. None of that red bottom high heel stuff. He likes his feet very low to the ground, center of gravity, closer to nature. Damn, at least Al Bundy got paid to play with women's feet. Why doesn't he get a job selling women's shoes and contribute something to society, you foot-following freeloader? She described having nightmares because of the incident, like Freddy Krueger chasing you around in your dreams but the claw is on his feet though going into the community and doing this to women is absolutely disgusting it is and I don't think he realizes what it's doing to us as the victims Chanel said back in June 2016 when Johnson was 20 authorities in Nebraska he had to get a hold of some corn husker tootsies once cited him for hiding under a woman's car to touch her feet it's something Johnson has done many times before in 2016 Johnson told Nebraska law enforcement he sexually attracted to women's feet and at times can't control his sexual desire. There you have it gals, Jesse Michael Johnson, the boogeyman, but for feet though, be sure to check for him under your beds tonight.